Idaho News 6 forecast. We saw a pretty good lightning show to the east and southeast of Boise last night, but all those storms are lifting to the north and east, and we have a dry Friday ahead, but we are going to see some additional cloud cover that is moving ashore in Northern California that will make it here a little later this afternoon and we'll watch that cloud cover increasing a little bit. So that will actually keep our temperatures a couple of degrees cooler today, but we do warm things right back up for our weekend. So really no fall weather in sight as we do move through the last couple of weeks of summer. Temperatures in the mid 80s for Boise will be up to 73 in McCall. We're not seeing much uh, movement with our temperatures. We do uh, add a few degrees on for Saturday into the upper 80s and a few locations in the Treasure Valley will likely get up to around 90 degrees. And here's that forecast for the Boise Broncos home opener. We are starting off in the upper 80s. We're going to see that sunshine really beating down, so you'll definitely want sunscreen and definitely try, uh, try to stay hydrated. Those temperatures will fall into the 80s by halftime and then down into the 70s by the end of the game. And here's your temperature trend over the next week. Again, our temperatures are not moving much at all. We're going to be in the mid to upper 80s, gradually cooling off a little bit into next week, but still we're talking temperatures in the mid 80s. Now we don't really have a lot of rain on the way either. We are going to see a low pressure system moving towards the Pacific Northwest as we move into early next week, but that's going to kind of graze northern parts of our area. So we could see a couple of showers clipping the McCall area, but we are going to stay dry here in the Treasure Valley and then a high pressure ridge building in for the rest of the week. So really no rain in sight. Those temperatures staying above normal average highs down into the lower 80s. So we'll be in the mid and upper 80s as we saw and we'll keep those conditions pretty dry. Uh, over the course of the next couple of weeks. So heading towards the start of fall, we are seeing those highs in the mid 80s today. 85 for Boise will get up to 84 in Caldwell. Again, we'll see some sunshine in the morning, giving way to some cloud cover in the afternoon. And we will see a little bit of a breeze up in the higher elevations today at about five to 10 miles per hour, nothing too major. But as you head a little further to the east, we are going to see that wind being a little bit gusty, especially from Fairfield over to Haley, where I think we could see a few wind gusts up to around 30 miles per hour for your Friday, but nothing too terrible. And our uh, Magic Valley uh, locations, 80 83 for Twin Falls, 82 for Jerome, and we'll see a lot of sunshine throughout the day. So pretty pleasant end to our work week and that pleasant weather continues. We'll clear out of that cloud cover for the weekend sunshine for both Saturday and Sunday and highs in the upper 80s to around 90 degrees in the Treasure Valley. And we're still pretty warm into Monday and Tuesday, and then those temperatures getting a little bit closer to normal, but still about five degrees above normal. And the Magic Valley looks like we have a fantastic weekend, those highs in the mid 80s, and we continue that weather next week. A lot of sunshine, really not looking at any rain in our forecast. We'll have the chance for some mountain uh, showers and storms, but in the valleys we are staying nice and dry towards the middle to end of next week. We may start to see those temperatures falling a little bit in the Magic Valley down into the upper 70s and low 80s, but otherwise that warmer, warm and dry weather persists.